So this isn't just a normal best of seven match. This, there's not just pride on the line here. There's something even bigger. The loser of this best of seven match eats their own Electromite live on video. And I just ensure that this is his Electrum. The same, this same Electrum is getting eaten very soon. The loser eats their own Electrum. The loser eats their own Electrum live on video. So put in the comments below who you guys think is going to win. Steven or Rohan. Now, without further ado, let's get straight into the profile. But before we do, any thoughts? Uh, yeah. what, what do you think of our matchup, bro? Who do you think is going to win? Me or you? Be honest for the fans. Okay, let me be honest. I, I've seen what your prior fan loves actually. The 60 cards, all that nonsense, whatever. I look at my 40 card consistent build. Consistent one to game. I'm, you're like a T1 Terminator. I'm like a T1000, okay? Uh, yo, can you say that in English, please? Because I actually had no idea what you're saying. He don't understand. He don't understand. This is beyond your understanding. You can't fathom it. Okay? You're right. I actually have no idea what you just said. Okay. <laughs> when we get into it. Okay. Okay. To be honest, though, like, I think it favors me just because 40 deck's more consistent. Okay, so you think 40 more consistent. So it's very consistent to negates, and my uh, 60 card deck very consistently five negates. We'll see how it goes. Oh, you guys are gonna love this match. Honestly, the, I'll make sure after I 4 0 you, bro. I'll make sure after the 4 0. Yeah. I'll ensure that I'll just. It'll be 3 0. I'll give you a few games just for the sake of it. And then I'm gonna beat you. Should I just give you. Should I let you go first, too? Oh, we'll see how it goes. <laughs> Anyways, guys, this is Rohan Thomas's updated Woo! deck profile. Yo, oh, oh. Let's get into it. Alright, first off, Jackalope. two jackals, obviously. Just uh, free monster negate. Three Cerebrus. Now, when you're playing Cerebrus, <laughs> you use this to bait the Ash uh, and bait the negates. And when you're going second and you want to break boards, literally, oh my gosh, like in the Penland Mirrors match, this card is so it can't be destroyed by card effects as soon as you get four counters on there. They're going to be scrambling over one Cerebrus, like Stephen will. So, okay. Two Abyss Actor. This is the new uh, addition because you need to. Because you watch my videos, match. yeah. Yeah, I mean, okay, whatever, whatever you say. Uh, <laughs> to Abyss, actually, because I need to make it even more consistent, even though it's already consistent enough. But uh, even better, so just it like can gain 2200 uh, attack and yeah. be over stuff. Yo, no one knows about that. <laughs> <laughs> no one knows. There's a lot of small stuff, like yeah. the Cerberus and the Razor. Uh, there's a lot yeah. of small stuff with these that no one knows, but if you know about the deck inside out, which it's good that it looks like I have a worthy opponent here that actually understands this deck, which is fantastic. Uh, a lot of people like, don't understand a lot of stuff, but it's not gonna work on me. But like against normal people, like it's actually genius. It's, like, it's gonna, no one sees those stuff coming. It's you know? gonna be the little things that'll win. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Three chronograph, obviously. Uh, especially some bizarre. It's pretty good. Yeah, it's pretty good. Uh, still playing three apex. Okay. Okay. So you still have to play it. It's in the gate, and it's how you can win going second, at least against like big boards, like five negates, whatever. You already, this card <laughs> literally takes out like two of the negates. And uh, if I saw it during the like Sky Striker matchup, like it's really good also. So, uh, alright, alright. Back row. Three Dark Gun, you need three of this. This is the big boy. People, I don't know why, they like to ash it on Mobile Summon and they like to ash it off Shrine. I don't know, so. It's too good. Too many pluses off that with Dragon Shrine. Two Donuts. Um, definitely, you just need to play two because if you draw one and you have this in your hand, it's just you're not getting more advanced than you need. And it's good for uh, making a um, absolute zero. So. One pit. I can't tell you how many games this has saved me. Yeah, it's box. It's right actually there. like it can um, break my hands. Like sometimes I have a dark on my hand. Yeah. I need to like ditch away and hit back row. Card's necessary. It's boys. and you can search off pen call. So yeah. like it's literally searchable MSC that you get in your deck. Yeah. One janky because I do play Zyrus and I don't like having my harm rising not being a level seven off. Yeah. And plus it negates lights, so goodbye, sold. Uh, time gazer, and this too. Again, if you don't understand the little things of sec, like yeah. his uh, monster effect protects your skills from being blown out. Yeah. So they're gonna make oh yeah, twin. What is this little thing doing here? Whatever, you just forgot it because it's easier. Yeah. But it protects your skills. Yeah. Kept your switch. Three OG wisdom eye, still Lit. surviving. Doesn't Lit. matter. Is it the structure deck version? No. Yes. First okay. Time. Okay. Okay. I see you. So are mine. And the league gets your skills, and it just gives you more rank four still. Two oh. Need to play two. After you, you want to spam your harm rising as much as possible from your hand. So getting it like this off, or like the, when you've already made your board, and next turn you want to gain them even more, even though you've already won, you can just be like, like flex on them with ulti ignicers and supreme things. Liddy. Three harmonizing. Up there with Wisdom Eye, one of the best ones. It's, it's a one card negate. <laughs> <laughs> two perp, two fang. 
You need fodder in this deck, especially because you're playing Desire Sector so later on. So you don't want to banish like all like your pendulums only have like one fang left and the one that you special on is banished. And also again, like Perp is good at like outing stuff, like again against the big boars. If you just make like a jackal and you swing into something, not only will you have a negate, you'll also be able to pop stuff and destroy it by battle. Now just one sec, bro. Now what he said right there is all hundred percent true. I just wanna show you guys something real quick, okay? So, what a lot of people have issues with right now, playing Pendulums, and this is two of the greatest Pendulum minds in the game right now, even though one is far smarter than the other, me. But, regardless, this is the biggest question a lot of people have. What Magician Counter are they going to play in the deck? So, Triple Wizard, Triple Harmonizing is fine, uh, but one issue I, I have to tell everyone with these, these break your hand. They're all Garnets. Even Wisdom in itself are Garnets, unless you draw in conjunction with other stuff. These suck, uh, uh, drawing them by themselves, unless you even draw five magician, they suck. So, one thing to know and to keep in mind is, oh, one black bag, one purple poison is most likely correct, but having this in terms of utility for the long run is also good, but do not play more than this count. This is literally the absolute maximum, like don't even fathom it in your mind about playing one more magician than this. In fact, this might just be a little too much, no offense, Ro no offense Rohan, uh, there might be even too many magicians. You want to ensure that you don't draw too many of these, because they're only, they're literally garnets. You only want them in this skill, you don't want them on the field with the exception of the harmonizing and the Oaf Dragon. So don't play too much, that's all. But regardless, Rohan's onto the right idea in terms of uh, the, the theory of the deck and everything. Oh, onto the spells. Yeah. I tied bump down uh, desires to two because I wanted to make it like even more consistent than with the uh, three because I found that not draw only can you draw one. drawing into one yeah. and um, banishing like stuff that you need and getting ashed, so yeah. reduce those chances. I think like two is perfect. And I decided to bump down pen call to two again, same reason almost because I don't want to get ashed and also like it's also like it's it's good when you like see it, but you don't want to see like too many copies of it. But even if you do see doubles, like you can just ditch the other one off, so it like, breaks your hand. And then obviously, arguably like, one of the best spells in the deck. Yeah. Like, you yeah, activate this and you literally get two cards for free off of it. So it's a plus one. And that's it for the main deck. Sick. Ten times better. Yeah, ten times better than Sky Striker, is he right? Not ten times better than my deck. <laughs> okay. One Electro, which I'm not going to eat, so Steven, uh, okay, okay. get your palate ready for this. Bro, one. I will eat your Electrum after I beat you, even though the, the bet is that you have to eat it. I'll eat it anyways. Oh my god. <laughs> one Boro Load for uh, Thunder Dragons, because you literally make us against Thunder Dragons and you, like, you win. Yeah. You just chain block. Their only out to it is like, literally the Titan, and you just reduce it by 500, take it, and then you can trigger off their effects, actually, when you steal the Titan. Yeah, yeah. One left for Nicholas. Yeah, so people take the Colossus, they just passed. <laughs> exactly. That's hilarious. One left for Nicholas, just yeah. in case your electrum gets hit. Utility. You can make this, or when you're coming up next play and all your zones are filled underneath like your yeah. Zephra. So you just clear it with this, make two Freeling zones, get your uh, Synchros out. Bull Sword, I mean, the OTK is really yeah. important for Pandos. Yeah. That's what makes it like a really good deck, yeah. because there's very few decks that can OTK quite like yeah. you can. And three hand traps. Especially when you bait them with a bunch of random stuff. Exactly. Then just blow There's so in much bait in the pendulums, yeah. which is why I love it so much. Yeah. Uh, that's it for the links. Best synchros, probably, in the whole deck, which because the other ones. But ulti ignicer, I mean, it's amazing. It gets rid of anything. I think it's amazing because it's ulti, but it's effect, <laughs> it's effect not so much. Uh, <laughs> Except for the mirror. Salt. It's fucking it's so beautiful in the <laughs> yeah. mirror. It's a mirror. Is I, good. I, I really don't like two of these. I know I, you really like those two. I, I, I think like, one okay. I don't play any. You have to. I play. don't like them, especially like, them. like in the mirror match. But you, your build's more focused on uh, on uh, the synchro <laughs> harmonizing yeah. magician anyway, so it's yeah. a little different. Because like, but I do recommend like just personal like uh, just friendly help here. That I do recommend playing with one of these. I think two is like way too much. My personal opinion. If you were gonna cut one, like I would say they cut yeah. the nicer. But yeah. I but in the mirror match yeah. keep it because like it's, it's not so good. Mirror. Because guess against like ult, like Altergeist and other decks, they struggle against big monsters like yeah. these, so that's really good. And then on for the one fused absolute package, Vortex, super good if you can pull it off on going second. Because you can return stuff to the hand, and then, especially in like a Sky Striker, you could bounce like the Shizuku and the Rail Strike Trigger and you just negate it, yeah. so that was good. So the Rito, real quick. Exactly. And then like you link into like Boro Load and stuff with, yeah. with the Absolute, and then you make yeah. that on top of it, it's too much advantage. Naruto, amazing. Uh, if you usually good for when you're going second. Abyss Dweller describes actually a lot, very a lot, uh, like underrated, I think, because if you some decks, especially the Dark Warrior Goki, you make this pass and they if they don't have an answer, like that's it. Yeah. And then next turn you just pendle your like harmonizing this stuff. 
Nightmare oh, of was so like I didn't make I didn't see any like Thunder Dragon or like any like kind of like decks where it was relevant. But against Thunder Dragon and against, and against Pendulum's like I don't think it's like good against Thunder Dragon. But oh, this card's amazing though. Against Pendulum, it's nuts. But against Thunder, Thunder Dragon, Dragon, it's nuts. What do you mean? You just put so. the Colossus down the extra. Unless it is. Like they'll take care of it before. It, and okay. If they get that far, I don't know. We'll have to read disagree. Tornado, just generic removal for back row. And this guy, really yeah. good for OTKing. Yeah. Um, Especially when they don't see it coming. If they don't, which exactly. I, I love for the whole extra deck. That's why I try and beat into the Mansiga. Then when they don't see it coming, just like, exactly. goodbye for and GG. And then especially in time, because <laughs> if you pump out like too much of damage, it's going to be hard for them to come back. Yeah. And especially if like, sometimes you just pedal some, like a bunch of monsters and yeah. just in defense and just stay there. In the yeah. They can't get over it in a perp in defense. Yeah. And then, uh, that's it for the extra. On to right. the side. And just so everyone knows, this is the exact same decks we're going to be using against each other. Exactly. So watch as we duels, you get in the minds of both of us. The Pen God and, and Pen God Jr. <laughs> Good one. Um, three Droll. Um, I thought it was really good at, like, because this is an OTK deck, you want to stop your opponent from doing anything at all. And I think Droll's really good at doing that. But even Especially against, like, Pendlums, like, yeah. if you, like... I ran on the pen call. I, well, even Pendulum's such a resilient deck. Not even Joel heard it, but... Yeah. <laughs> so, my my against, like, Sky Striker, against, like, Dark Warrior, Goku you nonsense, um, yeah. it's too good. Uh, three boots, because back row decks are annoying. Especially ones that run traps. <laughs> even though they're... Yeah. Those, it is job. Yeah. And then, uh... <coughs> gamma Package. Yeah. I honestly think this is probably the best hand trap yeah. the format. When you draw Gamma, it's so sick. It's, like, good going first, yeah. good going second. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They try to gumbler you for like four, and you just chain this, and then you link off and make a line for Nicholas. Yeah, it's a GG. Uh, and plus, like, it dodges called by the grave. Yeah. So it was really good. And then three Ash, three standard. Um, so people are still playing Desires, people are still playing Engage, and nonsense like that, so it hits everything. Yeah. Too evenly. Um, Honestly, like, I feel like I try to play, I might just actually cut this, because this is an OTK deck, and I don't want to, like... Not go into battle phase. Exactly. Yeah. I want to end them that turn. I don't want to give them another chance. Yeah. Especially against Sky Striker. Like, you could even leave them, but, like, if they just draw the engage next turn, they're just going to, like, loop their afterburner, like, twice. Yeah. And, like, that's it, so. Also, they're a sick player. They're, like, they're a good player. They're not going to, like, set everything at Exactly. All. They're just going to sack it. So, actually, I'd probably, I might cut this for, like, Hey, True Nate or Denkos. True Because I feel true. like it's good, but, like... There's a better scenario where you just go for yeah. game instead of or doing another twist your dark worm and see him Yeah, twist your, exactly. Twist your ditch dark worm. So. Alright, bro. Alright, bro. Goodness. Your deck's not as bad as I thought. Your deck's not as bad as I thought. You're gonna prove to be a worthy opponent, that's for sure. So, everyone, that's Rohan Thomas, the challenger. Any last remarks before we head out to the, to the champion's deck? Yes, uh, I've got something to say just before we end. Uh, to uh, Mr. Uh, Trifnowski here. Listen. I want you to know, like, when, 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 I, when I beat you... Oh, yeah, what? When I beat you to your soul... Yeah, what's gonna happen? This is what... You're literally... I want to see an apology video for you even trying to say you're the Pen God. Okay. Sincere... Oh, even more sincere than the Robbie Cole one. Even more. But the Robbie I, Cole one was straight from the heart. Alright, so let's say straight from the heart then. So okay. For me. Tell you what, bro. On your knees in tears. I would rather <laughs> yes. die than go on my knees. Secondly, unlike... Oh, never mind. Sauce is not here. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, okay. Well, okay, I agree. What well, you just said, I accept. Loser eats their own Electro. And if I lose an extra side bet, I will make a personal video <laughs> apologizing that I've ever roasted you and saying that you suck. The thing is, that's not going to happen. Because you do suck. And I'm going to destroy you. But... If that doesn't happen, Stop. if that doesn't happen, you would have proven me wrong, and I'm gonna make a video proving that. But that's literally like the grass is not purple, the grass is green. So we live in Canada, not in Antarctica. So with that being said, I am going to obliterate you, and that apology video is not coming. In fact, I want to see an apology video from you. <laughs> okay, exactly. For ever even doubting, for even saying, for not saying sir to me. <laughs> In regards to anything pendulum related, <laughs> a master might be the better word. But expect that, boys. A podge meter from one of us, and the loser eats their own electro. My deck football coming up in the next video, and then game one coming right after. Hope you enjoyed the video. Make sure to subscribe for more content. See you guys next video. Peace.